In an interview with NBC News at his homestead at Etiliasa village in Omsati region, Dr. Shangula says the expansion of the services remains crucial to the ministry as a means to ensure inclusive health services. However, Dr. Shangula was quick to point out that government's efforts alone will not achieve a healthy society and requires a collective undertaking with other stakeholders. We will continue to improve on the offerings and also on the quality of service. But I also want to state that we are also looking forward to the cooperation of the public. Because without the cooperation of the public, that we will not be able to achieve what we intend to achieve. Health is a collective responsibility. It demands the cooperation of everybody, starting from our own homes, in our own environment, and for us to ensure that we maintain personal hygiene, we protect ourselves from contracting illnesses, through vaccinations, through vaccinations, through good practices, so that we minimize the number of people who are coming to the health facility to come to, 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 to get medical aid. Prevention is always better than cure, so that we only deal with those cases which are not amenable to prevention. So this is my call. To the public. COVID-19 pandemic heavily impacted on outreach health programs and a lack of sufficient manpower to provide prompt services. Following the surge in COVID-19 cases reported in Latin America and China, Dr. Shangula says the situation in Namibia is still under control and government is ready to deal with any outbreak. In the event there will be an upsurge in the number of new cases, we are prepared to deal with those as we have done uh, in the past. The foundation has been laid, the infrastructure is in place, we have acquired additional human resource, and some of them they can be called on short notice. We have uh, improved on our diagnostic cap capabilities, we also have improved on the provision of uh, medicine. So. I can rest the public that uh, I can rest assure the public that they do not need to fear. The only thing is to listen to what the government is telling you, them. To listen to what we are telling them. No any other sources because there has been a, a number of uh, false claims of so many things which cause confusion within the public, but. Just listen to what the ministry is telling you. We will never let you down. We will never uh, 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 tell you something which is not correct. Uh, just have trust in your government.